Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to transfer your crypto from Binance to another wallet. So before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So the first thing that we need to do here is we need to log in into our Binance account. So go to Binance.com, log in into your account, and once in here, we now need to access our wallet. Now, typically at the top right of the screen, you should be able to see a icon here that looks or resembles like your wallet. So let's go ahead and hover over it. And from here, what you need to do is you need to go to your spot wallet. Now, once in here, what we need to do next is we just need to click on the option that says withdraw. In this case, let's go ahead and click on it. Now, once you've done that, you should be able to see this page here. Now, what you need to do is you just need to choose your coin. So for example, maybe I want to say I want to transfer ETH here. In this case, you need to basically choose who you want to send to. Now, if you're going to send to another Binance user, you could go and click on Binance user here, and you just need to enter their email for you to transfer that specific crypto to uh, actually uh, transfer that specific crypto. In this case, uh, if you have or you want to transfer this to a different wallet that is outside of Binance, choose the address option here. Now, what you need to do is you need to enter your address or the address of the recipient. Now, once you've entered the address, you also need to specify the network. Now, in the network section, it's actually really important that you choose the correct network. Now, the recipient of that specific uh, amount should also be using the same network itself now in this case maybe i want to say i want to use eth here but the receiver should also be using the erc20 as well whenever they are actually are uh, receiving that specific crypto now um not using the appropriate crypto or basically the appropriate network here can result of your crypto being lost so you won't be able to recover that in this case choose your network and also take in mind about the ETH balance. So you have the minimum withdrawal here as well as the network fee. Now the network fee here depends on the current traffic right now or the current um, network fee. So you, you wouldn't know. Sometimes it's actually really high, sometimes really low. So keep in mind about the network fee, fee here because it's going to be deducted from your wallet itself. Now, in this case, you could go ahead and just proceed with your transfer. So typically, when you enter your address here, you should be able to see a transfer button at the bottom right of your screen. Now, in this case, once you click on the transfer button, you should be able to proceed on transferring your crypto to another wallet. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.